you three exercises for lazy days. My name is Goldminka. I'm a burlesque performer and a belly dance teacher. And here on my YouTube channel, you will get burlesque dancing and tutorial videos for a beautiful you. So if you're interested in this, subscribe to my channel and also press this little bell next to it. So you will always get a notification every time I publish a video. Yes, and maybe you all know those lazy days where you just want to hang around and sit around and sleep and doing nothing, eating, watching TV and yes, but you also know it would be better to practice a little bit my burlesque routine or to do something uh, nice for my body and yes, then I have good new news for you. It's all possible. You can be lazy and practice at the same time. And what you can do, I will show you now. <laughs> so for um, doing my lazy exercises, I sit down on my meditation pillow. You can also sit down on a chair or on your sofa like you want. But the most important part is you sit. <laughs> but uh, when sitting, nevertheless, sit straight. So don't just hang like this, but sit straight. And now I will show you the three exercises you can perfectly practice while sitting. Exercise number one is our beautiful shoulder shimmy or chest shimmy. And um, yes, remember the shoulder shimmy is a rotation of your rib cage around your spine. This means one shoulder comes front, so your right shoulder comes to the front, the left shoulder automatically goes back and your chest is pointing to the diagonal of the room. And now the other way around. The left shoulder comes front, the right one goes back, your chest is pointing to this part of the room. So this is now the slow motion shoulder shimmy or chest shimmy. And when you speed it up, you have this, yes. <laughs> beautiful move. It's one of the best movements in burlesque and it's perfect for practicing it while sitting because here only our chest or our ribcage, our shoulders are moving and your pelvis stays still. So this is a perfect exercise and it's even really effective to practice it from time to time while sitting because yes, you really can keep your pelvis still. You don't move your pelvis with this and this makes the chest shimmy even look more beautiful. If you want to learn this beautiful move more in detail, you can watch this video here. It's one of the first videos here on my channel and there I have explained and broke down the shoulder shimmy a little bit more in detail. So chest shimmy or shoulder shimmy is movement number one and perfect for lazy days. Movement number two is also a movement in our yes upper body of course. And this is the beginning of the camel move. So I show you again, the camel move is this body wave that starts in your upper body and then it flows down like a water wave into the ground. And the beginning of this movement is a circle in your upper body. And this we can perfectly practice on our meditation pillow or sofa or chair. So for getting into this movement or for doing our um, yes circle in our chest we go front up back down front up back down and then you smooth this out 
front, up, back, down. You really hit all those four points. And yes, when you smooth this out, you have the perfect circle in your chest. And this is the beginning of the water wave or camel move. And as this is the beginning, this uh, circle in your upper body is the most important part of the whole move. You can really practice it from time to time while sitting and you really can enjoy being lazy and you will also feel uh, your muscles here, mostly these muscles here in your um, neck, in your shoulders, in your upper body are under tension when you sit all the day and yes now you have something you can do for um, getting loose here and for relaxing your yes your upper body and yes enjoy yourself keep the circle even breathe deep and yes this is movement number two if you want to learn the whole movement, the whole body wave or camel move, you can watch this video here. <laughs> so this is movement number two. Now let's come to movement number three. Movement number three are these snake arms. Also a very beautiful move and actually I have never done a movement or a video about snake arms. If you want me to do a snake arm tutorial then just let me know here. And yes, so let's um, do our snake arms. There are many different ways of starting with this move. Um, we today now we lift one arm up and the other one is down while lifting one arm up. Be careful your shoulder is not touching your ears. Leave your shoulders down and your arm is up. And now we go down with this arm and come up with the other arm. And up, up, up and up. Now we alternate our arms and then we just do the movement a little bit smaller and a little bit softer and while getting softer and smaller with this move your arms yes do this nice and beautiful snake arm move Actually, while doing the snake arms, there are three points that you um, move in your arms. The first part is your shoulder, the second part your elbow, the third part your wrist. So these, these are the three um, parts in your arms that you move and this makes your arm look like snake arms. So shoulder, elbow, wrist. And again, shoulder, elbow, wrist. While doing this, keep your hands nice. Don't do something like this. So again, shoulder, elbow, wrist. While going up, you can also imagine that you, are, um, you have a broom here and you're painting the wall with this part of your arm. And then again, shoulder, elbow, wrist. Now you imagine you have the broom here and you paint the wall with this part of your hand. And now we do it with both our arms. And yes, you can really um, take every imagination that helps you for getting this movement nice, soft and beautiful. Another beautiful imagination is that you are in water, you are a water plant and your arms are just moving with the water. <laughs> and yes, so let's continue this a little bit. <laughs> and yes, and let's enjoy our beautiful lazy Sunday. I really like doing 
all these three exercises we had here because yes this is a perfect combination of practicing and enjoying being lazy so yes you never have to have a bad conscience again you can really practice all those moves So now even my camera was lazy and just switched off. <laughs> and yes, so we just continue being lazy and practice our beautiful snake arms or our shoulder shimmies. <laughs> and the upper body circle for the beautiful camel move and yes i hope you enjoyed being lazy with me and all these exercises you can really perfectly do from time to time in the evening when you are lazy and you just want to sit watch tv or on sundays when you just or when you don't feel fine every time you just you know you should practice, but you don't want to. So now you never have to have a bad conscience again. Just enjoy these beautiful moves. And just in case you are in the mood of dancing now, you can watch my other videos here. And thank you very much for enjoying this lazy Sunday with me. See you in my next video. <laughs> Bye. Yeah. <laughs>